Hello everyone, welcome to Aesthetic Fitik. So in this video, I am going to discuss about the ways to control browning reactions. Browning reactions, especially enzymatic browning, create undesirable changes in foods. We all know about the browning reaction that occur in fruits and vegetables. And this is creating very difficulties in fruits and vegetables processing industries. So hence, it is very important to control browning reaction. And there are certain ways to control enzymatic browning reaction to prevent the undesirable color changes or undesirable changes in fruits and vegetables or foods that undergoes enzymatic browning reaction. And they are extrusion of oxygen, application of heat, pH treatment, reducing agents, refrigeration, freezing, dehydration and irradiation. First one is extrusion of oxygen. We all know that oxygen play an important role in enzymatic browning of foods. And methods like syruping, brining, vacuum treatment can be used to prevent the action of oxygen in foods. Syruping means using syrup in treating foods. Syrup is a solution that is made by mixing sugar and water. Similarly, brining can be done by treating foods with brine solution. Brine is a solution made by mixing salt and water. Vacuum treatment can be done where food is treated in the absence of oxygen, hence enzymatic browning can be prevented. Second method is application of heat. Blanching can be done in fruits and vegetables to prevent enzymatic browning. The major advantage is that blanching inactivate enzymes. So, enzymatic browning can be prevented. Blanching means it is a heat treatment done in fruits and vegetables. pH treatment is another method that is used to prevent browning reaction. Citric acid, malic acid, ascorbic acid can be used to treat with foods to prevent enzymatic browning. Reducing agents can be used to prevent browning reaction because in browning reaction, the process taking place is oxidation of foods. Hence, reducing agents help to prevent oxidation. Sulfur dioxide, ascorbic acid can be used to prevent enzymatic browning in foods. Finally, refrigeration, dehydration, freezing and irradiation. These kind of preservation methods can be used to prevent the enzymatic browning in foods.